So guys, just finished eating at Lulu's Oyster Bar. You can see it right there. And I wasn't able, and I'll walk into the house right now, but I wasn't able to record it because they wouldn't let me record. Like I was recording when I first went in there, but they wouldn't let me do any anything else. So I just left it at that. So right now I just got finished eating. Uh, my mom, my stepdad, and my sisters and my brother are still in there eating right now. I'm a lost that I could walk home because since I'm already done, it's right across the street, right over there. So, see you guys in a second. So, just waiting here for the running man to show up on the sign before I cross the street because. You can see this street is pretty busy right here. So the running man should show up pretty soon. Yep, here he is. So if you guys are wondering, wondering, this is the place I, I'm staying at right here. It's called Island Sands. And I'll show you guys my point of view. We're going upstairs. So we are on the second floor up top here and we're almost there right up here and this is the place we're staying at right here the password on the door um, I can't show you guys that and we're back dang all the lights are turned off in here so if you guys are wondering what I ate, oh, I was like 50 million light switches. They're all not working. So, if you guys wonder, oh, there we go. If you guys wondered what I ate, I had salmon, lemon, scampi style. And on the side, I had mashed potatoes and mac and cheese. I was considering on doing the burger challenge, which it's a giant burger, it has four patties, eight slices of bacon, four slices of cheese, and has monstrosity of a side of french fries. And you have to finish eating all that in five minutes, I mean not five minutes, 20 minutes. So I was considering on doing that, but my mom wouldn't let me, she thought I was going to get sick. So that's why I didn't do it, I just left it at that. So. I'm about to call my mom, ask if I could head down to the beach so that I can show you guys, see if there's anything else I can find in the tidal pools. So right now I'm taking my socks off because I wouldn't want to head down to the beach with socks, especially with all the sand. So I'll call my mom and then I'll get in touch with you guys back after that. So guys, we are in luck. I just got finished. I just got off the phone with my mom, and she's right across the street, right over there. Not the gas station, right behind those trees right there is Lulu's Oyster Bar. So I just got off the phone with her. She said, it's okay with me to, oh, that's a nice car right there, right, right there. But I just got off the phone with her, and she said, in five minutes, she's going to call me back. To, and she's like she said that she wants me to answer my phone or else I'll be in trouble so I see you guys down at the beach I've not I'll say that like a hundred times but there's no there's really not another way to say it so I'll see you guys down there as I was walking by I saw another lizard he is right there oh we just took off oh there's another one right right there I'll try to get in as close as I can you guys can see him right there oh so we are right here down at the beach there's some people fishing right now I heard all right there's tide pools are kind of gone right now if you can kind of see it there's this beautiful sunset right behind me but I'm gonna see what I could find with what I have 
but I'll try it out. You guys see in my last video, I found a conch snail, which it was pretty nasty. So, see if I find anything, and I'll catch up with you guys. I'll see you in a minute. So, as you guys may see, as I'm walking along here, there's a bunch of people like right over there and right there. A bunch of people looking for shells because I think this is the best time of day to look for shells when the tide goes out. So, I wanted to tell you guys this. Um, Jace called me earlier today. As I told you guys, he's in summer school right now. But he called me earlier today saying that they evacuated the school because... I just got my pants wet. Because the, he said that the school caught on fire, which is really devastating. But um, it's only a little fire, not like the school burnt down or anything. Which I'm kind of glad because that's like my only hopes in getting a scholarship someday. So, yeah. As you can see, guys, the sun is slowly disappearing. There it is right there. Hopefully, we can catch, capture it disappearing right now while I talk to you guys. Oh, yep. It, right now, it is. It's gone now. So. I haven't found anything yet, but I'll see you back when I find something. As you guys may see here, there are a bunch of these shelves that I like. Some of them are intact, like this one. And no, no, definitely not that one. But there is, oh, that one washed away. There's this one. And kind of that one right there. There's, oh, no. It's the only thing I've found so far because high tide's coming in right now, as you can see. So guys, haven't found nothing yet. I'm thinking of turning around making my way back to the house, which is beyond that pink house right there. It's right next to it. So I'm thinking about turning around because I think now high tide's coming in. I can see it right there. I think that now high tide's coming in. That Everything got swept away. So make my way back to the house. So guys, I've stumbled across this thing right here, which is why we're not allowed down here at nighttime. But as you can see right there, the do not disturb sea turtles nest. Um, which is pretty cool. I've never seen a sea turtles nest in person, but this is what one looks like, which is pretty amazing. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there is a big hole right there. It's probably a crab or something because I can't go in there because it's all taped off right here, but it might be a crab because crabs like to burrow into the sand. So that's, and there's like little tiny holes right there next to it. So it may be a crab. I'm not sure. So if you guys have been watching our videos, someone suggested that we should do a Q&A. And if you put down in the comments of our videos any questions you guys would like us to answer, all get together as a group, me, Jason, Jonah, and do a Q&A together. But it sounds like fun and making my way back to the house right now. Just almost there. So see you guys in a minute. So tomorrow is our last day at the beach. And I'll try as much as I can to vlog as much as it at, for you guys. But I may not be able to because I'm trying to spend as much time as I can down the beach. But I'll try my hardest. But I'll record our, some of our road trip back. Which I'll, I'll try my best doing it because it's about 14 and a half hours in the car. Which is a lot. So I'll try to narrow it down as much as I can. And... You guys will see me a lot getting Baja Blast. Mountain Dew Baja Blast. It's the best drink in the world. So shout out for Mountain Dew for making that amazing flavor. So I'll see you guys up at the house. So going up the stairs right now, I'm not sure if everybody is back or still at Lulu's. And I'll be pretty mad if they got dessert without me. But I'm going to go up to the house probably end the vlog pretty soon and 
watch The Flash a little bit. By the way, that is a great show. Uh, shout out to my aunt. Not my Aunt Lisa, but shout out to her though. Um, but shout out to my Aunt Christine for getting me the San Francisco shirt. So it looks like they're back up the house. So I'll catch you guys up in a minute. Honey, I'm home. Yeah, say, we're missing time. I was looking for you. I'm like, no, Zach, I went to your home. Like, here. Oh, I was down at the beach. What'd you get? Huh? What'd you get? Uh, some salmon. How was it? It was delicious. Good. Good deal. So you can talk to your friend? He was right. Yeah. Salmon. Salmon. How's your ice cream? Um, tastes good. But you're a good ice cream. Yeah, they have a popsicle for the spoon. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Hey Landon, you know that's a spoon, right? So you don't chew on it. So you don't chew on it. The first thing came to the table, like, what do you want? I was like, I want an IPA. And you keep it all back. What do you want? Strongest IPA you can beer. <laughs> How bad did I get you? How bad? <laughs> so guys, I'm gonna close the vlog off right here. So don't forget to subscribe, hit that thumbs up, and see ya.